Sexy fragrances that drive women wild. Part three. Gentlemen, welcome back. My name is Kevin Samuels. In today's video, we're gonna do part three of my sexy fragrances that drive women wild. This is my anecdotal list. List that I've actually compiled from fragrances that I've worn out around the world, around the country, that I know women just lose their mind over. I will say for me, it works. Your mileage may vary, but for me, it works. You guys know I love rose, amber, and oud, but I also gotta tell you, incense and musk have a particular impact on women, and we're gonna get the list started off with none other than shout out to the CIA, one love FBI. If you wanna become part of the movement, make sure you join me on Patreon for exclusive video and live stream content. Join me on that platform for things you will only see there. Details down in the description. Armani Incense Satin, Amber Incense Masterpiece. Sadly, I think this has been discontinued. Get it while you can, guys, because I will say this, especially if you're dressed in like jeans and a nice V-neck cashmere sweater or a turtleneck, some boots, a leather jacket outside on a cool day, this stuff is hypnotic and drives women absolutely wild. Next up from Louis Vuitton, we have none other than Ombre Nomad. I'm sorry that you can't get your hands on it, but I'm glad I have it. This is the beast mode of a rose oud masculine fragrance. There's nothing weak about this stuff. Every fragrance on this list drips masculinity, and Ombre Nomad is no exception. And when I'm out and about wearing this, I feel bad for the guys because they're automatically competing for second place. This wins hands down. Next up from the master, we have none other than Tuscan Leather. But I'm also going to put from Louis Vuitton, we're going to put Nouveau Mondi. Both of these fragrances kind of fit together. Tuscan Leather is a raspberry leather fragrance that works well, especially when you're dressed in more formal, more special occasion, or a leather jacket. Nouveau Mondi and Tuscan Leather are very similar, except that one has a little cacao in it. Some people like that more than Tuscan Leather, but I would tell you, I have a decanter that one between this and Tuscan Leather, they both work. They drive women nuts. Next up, from Roja Dove, we have none other than Musk Oud. This is the AP version, and I'm sorry guys, your mileage may vary, but I will say this. Musk has always been a sexy fragrance note. Whether you just wear musk by itself, it was overdone in the 70s, so a lot of people just don't wear it these days. But musk is magical, especially on masculine skin. Women are drawn to this. This little bottle will last me about 10 years, and I will say this, that every time I just put a little dab on, psh, psh, game over, game over. I walk in and I'm like, ah, oh, because this stuff lasts forever. And it evolves, it cooks so well. Musk Oud AP, another fragrance that drives women nuts. All right, next up from the master Tom Ford, we have none other than Tobacco Oud or and Fabulous. I know a lot of people don't like and Fabulous, but I'm gonna tell you, you gotta understand who, was, what, who it was made for and what it was made to do. The candle is fantastic, the fragrance is fantastic because it gets women's attention. I've heard more women say, God, I love the way that guy smells on a guy. That's just reality, guys. The reality, effing fabulous works. So does Tobacco Oud. I made a video talking about great one night stand fragrances. I said this fragrance smells like liquor, cigarettes, and bad decisions. Guys, Tobacco Oud just smells like a man. It's harsh, it's brutal, it's right in your face, and women love it. Women love it, Tobacco Oud, Tom Ford, effing fabulous Tom Ford, both. Eggs Benedict approved. Next up from By Killing, we have Dark Lord. Vetiver, Jasmine, Rum. This fragrance did not get a lot of love when it first came out. You can't put this just on paper. You have to put it on your skin, wear it for about 20 minutes, especially when you're dressed more formally or in a leather jacket. That's what you're noticing here, formal or leather jacket, and see what happens. Guys, this stuff should be outlawed. It is so good, especially around feminine women. Feminine women love men to smell masculine, and this is one of the most masculine fragrances of the last several years. Works so well. By Killian, Dark Lord, yes please. Next on the list from House of Matriarch, we have Blackfin number one. 
Fragrance Foundation actually voted this sexiest one, the world's sexiest fragrance for good reason. The note breakdown is ridiculously long, but again, smells like leather and incense to me, guys. I would say this, when I've sat at the bar or something, I've had people come over to me and say, what in the world are you wearing? Black fear number one, and the fact that it's so exclusive, now a lot of people wear it and it's natural, kind of organic, even better. Drives women wild. Next on the list from Francis Kirk Jean, we have none other than Oud Silk Mood Extract the Parfum. The funny thing is, satin mood gets more love, but this gets better reactions. Very simple fragrance. Beast mode of a fragrance, another one of those that takes 20 or 30 minutes to dry down and the magic happens. But gentlemen, I tell you, this is magical. I've had, again, some of the most feminine, beautiful women just sit back, even on my channel, they've come on on video and say, I love the way this smells on a man. Yep, Oud Satin Mood Extract the Parfum. A little dab will do you because this stuff is strong and it works. And last, but certainly not least on the list, we have none other than Dior Homme Parfum. Dior Homme Parfum, three notes, what? Uh, sandalwood, leather, and iris, simply beast mode of a sexy, masculine fragrance. Guys, trust me, it simply works. It simply works and women are drawn to it. I've had women drooling over the way this, over the way this smells and none of the fragrances on this list can be confused for women's or feminine fragrances. Women dig these on your skin and will automatically take you and increase your testosterone. Even if you're a guy that a higher pitched voice and may be kind of corny. If you just sit back, strike a pose, hold your frame, keep your mouth closed, wear this, good things will happen. If you like this kind of video, go ahead and share it out with somebody that you think can use the information. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Until next time, talk at you later. Godfather, out. Hey guys, whether look, style, or life, whether personal or professional, you can level up and be your personal best each and every day. If you're interested in any of that, do us both a favor, follow the link in the description and book your one-on-one -on -one session with me. Details down in the description. Peace.